ventured out again. This was not here yesterday. Uh, I, I guess I could get to the barn, but there's no reason to. I can hear the wind. It's not, it's cold, it's not that cold. I'm not gonna stay out much longer. It's just the configurations of the snowdrifts are just so interesting. the garden over there. There's a big drift over there by the garden. This, and this is bare ground. Bare ground right here I'm walking on. Dogs are sliding around. The horses are glad to have their hay. And look over here where we mow the grass. I just couldn't tell you how deep that is. It's almost over my head. Very interesting. Just crazy. Ronnie loves it. There is a place you could walk through over there. Look at Ronnie having fun. <laughs> are you a Sheltie snowplow? You are a Sheltie snowplow. Plow through the snow. <laughs> Should I climb through there? Are you plowing the snow, you silly boy? Yep. All right, well, let's plow through here because there's more interesting snowdrifts. There's a snowdrift back here that actually goes over the fence. All right, let's move. <sighs> Come on. <clears throat> Come on, Sheltie. Plow through that snow, mister. Go. <sighs> I guess if you have a long nose, you use it as a wedge through the snow. If you're a schnauzer, however, you're a wiener and you don't like to go through the snow. Yeah, he's being a kind of a wiener today. Come on, Kenny. Yep, one more pass around the machine shed here. Yeah, the wind's blowing so hard you can't see that snowdrift that goes over the fence. Right there. <coughs> This is where I mow the grass all summer. It's under feet of snow. Look at that. Can you climb that wall, Ronnie? Yeah, we could have a snow fort. And I think I'd rather go in the house. Yeah, go over that snow fort. I guess that's a Sheltie form of King of the Mountain. 